Do we know where this guy is? I've got, do we have a time check on this guy? I've been here since 8.30. I've got 10 other places to go. I've got the idol show later. Oh, well, well, thank you for joining me. Thank God the show isn't ruined. L let's get him mic'd up. I am ready to go. Let's do this, guys. Welcome to Generic Daytime Television Entertainment Programming. I'm Zach Dolmage, and with me today is talk show host Neil Knightley. We're going to take a look at the man that is. Can we move this along, please? Okay, Mr. Knightley, but first, if you will, kindly explain all of this. And everybody's out to get laid. You got a show to run. Speaking of people trying to get laid... Winner! New Neil Knightley intern! Totally uncovered and totally awesome and yeah, yeah the yeah. first everywhere. Occasionally I have sex with the Karen Canadian's mother. Talia Russo. All of her. So you may as well have drunk sex with that cousin you always thought was pretty hot, but only tongue kissed that one time in your grandmother's attic. Hands in my pocket, hands in my pocket, hands in my pocket. All it is is porno and statistics on when girls lost their virginity. This is just a stick man jerking off. Neil Knightley's here to give the people what they want. And judging by the hits on our clips on YouTube that involve sex, it's obvious the people are horny. What are you doing today? Browsing? So? <laughs> uh, you know, being a jerk to people. <laughs> you do very well with that. I'm from this country. Do you have a problem with people from my country? Maybe you should take your ass to a new country and complain about something there. Or just fuck off and die. Offensive is funny. What's wrong with you? Are you a censor terrorist? A censor terrorist? What is a censor terrorist? But I know we're gonna catch shit for not censoring it. For example, you remember this commercial? I Leprechaun turns dude into a drumstick, girls take a bite, and he says, easy on the nuts. Well, here's the censored version. Whoa, wait a second. One at a time, ladies, mm. ladies, please. <laughs> Can you believe that even had to be censored? That was a clever way to be funny to normal people and not offend the other people. And by other people, I mean censor terrorists. Censor terrorists are all around us and are offended by virtually everything that makes us smile. If you suspect you know a censor terrorist, please do not approach them with any violence, nudity, coarse language, or peanut jokes. Due to a lack of communication between my office and the mayor's office, I offer these tips of getting away with drinking in public out of spite. Drink up, Canada. Buy cold shots. Tip number one. Buy Rockstar energy drinks. Wine juice boxes. Vodka freezies. Or boozies. The only time people drink things at mid-level is when it's coffee or it's alcoholic. Follow these steps and you'll never get busted again. I can't guarantee that, I guess. But I've never gotten busted. And, well, I'm drunk right now. Neil. Neil. I love your observations on celebrities. How witty. Unless, of course, it's Nickelback. They can get the 30 million teenage girls who keep buying their CDs to do that. Lindsay Lohan and Paris Hilton. Seriously, who gives a shit? Brett Hall, we didn't want him in the World Juniors, and we don't want him now. Nelly and Fergie. The stupid feud between Nelly Furtado and Fergie. Fergie continues on. I didn't have a freaking clue what it meant. I had to call David Suzuki. Do you know how hard it is to get a hold of that guy? He's against cell phone use and he is never home. Be careful. Fergie looks like a man and she probably hits like one too. Australia is toying with the idea of turning down immigrants who are HIV positive. That's funny. Wasn't Australia founded on a whole round them up and ship them to an island kind of policy? Chantel Kraviazic and Avril Lavigne. After Kraviazic accused Lavigne of stealing songs without even hearing them first, She's retracted her statements and issued an apology, blaming it on menopause. People rejoice! Katie Holmes is out of Batman The Dark Knight. Her character remains and will be recast. Someone tell this chick to stop making movies. Her and Tom should just pack up and move to an island. Maybe Australia. I hear they're still accepting losers. <laughs> you really want this guy in Day 5? He's stabbed me! The Chrysler Smart Car. 
If they're so smart, why do they look so stupid? I saw Eugene Levy making a public request for someone to please clean his star on Canada's Walk of Fame. Everyone just laughed at the funny man and no one did shit. When a man like Eugene Levy asks you to do something, get off your ass and do it. Eugene Levy, money where my mouth is, yo. More Neil Knightley coming up, so stick around. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's all the time that we have for today. I'd like to thank our guest, Mr. Neil Knightley, and reminding you all once again, thanks for joining me. I'm Zach Dalmage. This has been Generic Daytime Television Entertainment Programming. Thanks, everybody. And somebody get me my fucking aspirin. Jesus Christ.